Welcome to this demonstration video of SceneSet. Make sure that the lighting router is connected to the same network as the wireless access point, and then connect to that network using your device, such as a smartphone or tablet. The app searches for available lighting workgroups. Select one of them. In this example, only one is available, so we'll select that. And SceneSet connects to that workgroup. You get a notification that it's connected. When you've connected, SceneSet creates a default page called Group 1. For your first group page, edit this default page. Touch Settings and choose Edit This Page. Enter the group number. This matches the scene set group page to a group in the workgroup you set up in Designer. You can give this group a name that's used in the scene set app. The name doesn't have to match the name in Designer. You can also edit the scene names, and these names will appear on the buttons on the app. Decide if you want scene set to keep or to override constant light messages in the group, and then select the control type, level only, tunable white and level, or color and level. You can customize the background either by changing the color of three gradient points, or you can add a background picture. And now we're going to demonstrate that. You can either add an existing picture from your device, or take a photo and use that. This is the Helvar UK Canteen. Save that. You can crop it if you want to. and then accept it. Then the app reconnects to the network and you can see the background picture there, so you know very easily which group you're controlling. SceneSet can control multiple groups and it's simple to create and edit group pages and switch between pages. Settings, add a new page, and a new group page is created. Choose settings again, and enter the group number. And again, that group number links it to the group number you've set up in the work group. Enter a user-friendly group name for use in the scene set app. And enter user-friendly scene names for the group scene set buttons. Here we haven't changed them. Don't forget, you can toggle between maintaining constant light messages or not, and choose the control type. Here we'll choose tunable white and level. To edit the background colors, you have three gradient points. Set the color of each. We've chosen three blue points here for a plain blue background. The group page is now ready for use. If you want to switch between groups, tap the arrow at the top there and choose from the drop-down menu. We have two sets of LED lights here, color lights on the left and tunable white on the right. This group's page is set for full color control and you can recall scenes, You can dim down and fade up, and here you can open the orbits control for precise color control. The outer orbit is for hue. Then with orbit 2 choose saturation. and the inner orbit sets the level. And don't forget the off button. Now we switch to the other group, which has tunable white LEDs. You can see we've changed the background image, and you can choose scenes with different color temperatures and levels.
and you can fade up and dim the light. The Orbit control makes it simple to control the color temperature. and the level. That's the scene set up. How to connect, add group pages, edit them and switch between them, and how to control lighting. Thanks very much for watching.